Good morning everyone, welcome back to another video. So as you can see I've got my breakfast, 264 calories, it's just the protein granola, it's not a huge bowl but um, I'm just having a lighter breakfast because I'm heading to the gym basically straight after this. So as you can see from the title, I am starting a four week cut. Today is week one of my cut. I am going to get more into like the details, calories, macros, things that I'm changing, what I'm doing and the reason uh, in this video. But first, I'm just going to eat this, head to the gym. I think I'm going to record my workout so I'll insert it in this video. It's up at today push. So um, basically, a cut is basically just eating in a calorie deficit and the reason I'm doing it for four weeks, usually a mini cut, I would say most people do a cut for at least eight weeks, but I'm just going to do a four week cut. It's my third cut I've ever done, so I kind of like know what to do, like have experience doing a cut. Um, but yeah, I'm excited to make some changes, make some progress. I've took some before pictures just now. Um, so yeah, let's eat this and I'll catch up with you guys later. I've just got ready from the gym really good workout trained with my friends so we kind of like really pushed each other today I'm having a Americano coffee something that I am switching up is every time I have a second coffee if I have a second coffee some some days I just have one coffee I'm gonna have an Americano as that is like zero calories it's just a black coffee um, I do add a little dash of milk I am literally gonna be tracking everything and also for a little snack i'm gonna have this veggie burst basically mixed nuts it's 140 calories like nine grams of protein i just need a little snack a little something to keep me going so i'm heading shopping for like my full week of food lunches meal prep everything which i'll be getting today as well i'm just gonna do this coffee Yeah. Right, I'm gonna eat this and go shopping. Um so first of all I do just wanna talk about Oh you're right there, Pabs. <laughs> he thinks this is for him. This isn't yours. Okay, so number one thing I'm tracking calories again. Of course, if I'm not tracking, I don't know what I'm eating, I don't know if I'm hitting my goals, and the thing that I need to be hitting obviously is making sure I'm under my calories, so I'm eating in a calorie deficit and i'm getting enough protein in so obviously i i care about the carbs and fats but for me these are the things that obviously i am prioritizing in this cut also my workout is going to be um push pull legs and the fourth workout a week is going to be spin cardio and if i don't make it to a spin class i'll be doing four full body so that's four weight tra three weight training sessions one cardio um step goals i'm not giving myself a step goal i honestly 
do so many steps per day. Right now it's 12.30 p.m. and I've done 10,355 steps and I've still got a shift at work tonight. Like my, my steps are always through the roof, like 15 to 25,000 steps a day. So I am quite active and my job's active. I go to the gym regularly. I do a lot of walking, which is why my calories are a bit higher than maybe the average person doing a cut. So I am starting off at 1,800. Like I said earlier, if I want to move that down, lower it a bit, then I definitely will. I'm just going to see how I feel week to week and see how it's working for me. Um, so yeah, that is basically everything I wanted to start off this video with. Time to go shopping. I've got some meal preps for some lunches for the week. And I'm just going to think of some meal ideas that are going to keep me on track. I am not eating boring food. I love food. I love cooking. I love trying new recipes. Um, I love switching up my meals. Just because I'm on a cut, it does not mean I need to eat boring, bland meals. No. So, yes, make sure that you like this video. Subscribe. These are going to be every single week, every single Monday. Um, so, yes, that is enough talking from me. Eat this. My camera's flashing, so I need to charge this up. So, I'll catch up with you in a bit. Preparation is obviously key, meal planning, planning what you're having for like dinners and things, this is something that I'm definitely going to be on the ball with because if I don't plan something I'm just going to reach something, something unhealthy. So as it is now quarter past two, I'm so hungry, lunch is well overdue, um, I'm going to cook some lunch now and then meal prep some extra for the next couple of days. So I've got some basmati rice. chicken breast and I'm gonna cut up a bunch of salad in a tub ready to go but then if I want salad with any of my meals it's all cut up ready in the fridge to just grab so what I'm gonna do is get my peppers onions chicken fajita seasoning and just get all this in the pan get the rice in the pan and I'm also meal prepping for work tonight because I've got work because I'm working a late shift I am just gonna cook what I'm taking now as well so I've got these like baby carrots i'm just going to cut the ends off wash these i'm going to roast these in the oven and i'm going to cut these into chips and get these in the air fryer everything cooked in one one calorie fry light so i've got two extra portions here this is the portion for today everything's weighed out i just need to add salad and anything extra that you want to add add it on now so I'm just chopping up a big salad and putting that in a tub for the fridge just to grab with any, any meals this week. So I've just topped mine with some pickled red cabbage and I'm just going to put a bit of cheese on the chicken so I'm just going to weigh that out now. So here is lunch 384 calories. Let's enjoy. that I'm taking to work 140 calories 17 grams of protein I always speak about these love them a little bit of fruit blueberries and strawberries I'm going to take this to have a hot chocolate as that is just 40 calories and a diet coke started a new podcast she is a youtuber so lift it if you watch her and 47 minute walk done and most mornings i do a long like 40 45 minute walk walk my dog to school and back and obviously i have a dog so i need to walk my dog anyway so i'm just gonna have my black americano coffee 
take this hoodie off, put a gym top on. I've got these leggings on, but I need to like put my gym outfit on. It's really annoying going to the gym in a hoodie, like although it's comfortable, sometimes it's just I'm just so hot, I just can't deal. So I'm just gonna put a crop top on or something. Head to the gym, it's leg day today. As well as tracking and saving in my calories, I am also like not gonna skip any workouts now I, I didn't before like you know sometimes but i really want to prioritize my main compound lifts like so today's leg day so i need to be doing hip thrusts walking lunges leg press i need to be doing some heavy lifts start my workout then move on to the accessory work like of course everyone should be prioritizing their compound lifts but i really do want to make an effort to progress with that not just because I'm on a cup, because I just need to anyway. I'm just kind of more motivated to do that now. Now that my left glute is not pulled anymore, like I'm not injured anyway, like I'm just so much more motivated to like progress in the gym as well. So anyway, let's have this coffee and get to the gym. So I had some leftover chicken, carrots, the chunky chips and the wrap which I forgot to fold the sides but yeah this is dinner. So obviously, fifth day of the cut today. Um, I would so where we're going. I would usually have like a bit more of a bigger breakfast, maybe like a what do you call it? Them yogurt bowls with the granola. And honestly, when you think about the calories, it's so high in calories. So I am um, having something a bit different today to make sure I stick within calories. Um, so yeah, we are heading there now. Yeah. So this is avocado, bacon and poached eggs. Oh, I'm just going to remove the fat of the bacon and, and this is breakfast. For that. Ah. Finally got my package from the Skinny food company, so I'm just gonna open it on camera now. I can't even remember what I got. <coughs> Everything was gifted. I think they might have a discount code. I'm not sure if I have. I'll link it in the description. This is so perfect for this cut. I've got a treat for tonight. 87 calories, chocolate malts, basically Maltesers. Peach flavor iced tea syrup with sweetener. I'm gonna have to try some of this. Banana and caramel skinny syrup. Barbecue ketchup. Oh, stay barbecue ketchup. <laughs> I'm excited for this. <laughs> <coughs> Garlic ketchup. Now that sounds even better. Some chocoholic spread. Hazelnut and strawberry. So good. And some chocoholic spread. Hazelnut and banana. So, so far with the cut it's been going well I've not been hungry I've just been planning my meals to make sure that look I have like more volume in my meals so I'm still full 
um yeah i feel like these calories are working for me at the moment i feel like if i ate, if i ate less than what i'm eating now i would be starving so that is everything for this video i'm just going to go ahead and end the video here so every single week on a monday it's going to be my cut videos so everything i'm eating changes recipes all stuff like that is going to be included in these videos i'm probably going to do some what i eat in the days as well so look out for them make sure you give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and subscribe if you are new here so thanks for watching and i'll see you next week